Hello everyone. In this video I'm going to show you all how to navigate through the Canvas shell. So uh, the first thing we have here is our modules. So um, let's go ahead and click on this but this is how the entire class is organized and it makes it super simple to follow. So if you click on modules I have the getting started before you begin week one, week two and everything's broken down by week. Um, this is all sort of subject to change so uh, when you click on it just keep note that uh, some of this may be a little bit different by the time you check it. Um, however this is how the layout will be for the entire course all the way down to your final project. So um, I have the educational license for Maya. This is a free download for the software that we will be using all semester so you need to check this and get this downloaded uh, right away um, in fact it's under your first week uh, for uh, Maya installation on, under discussion so uh, that is the first thing um, the Adobe Creative Cloud for students there is a small fee on this uh, you do get an educational discount however they have different packages so depending on what other classes you might be taking you may want to be uh, choosing a different package for whatever reason. However, the only software we really need on for this class is Adobe Photoshop. So um, I'm going to leave links in there. Uh, you can go ahead and check through it. Um, but we won't need the Creative Cloud right away. I don't believe it's until week five where we get into texturing. So yeah, about week five we get into texturing. So uh, again, this is all sort of subject to change, so keep that in mind. But um, for the first few weeks you won't need uh, Photoshop yet. Um, I leave the keyboard shortcuts but I do include them all in um, the videos that I'm showing you so every single assignment will have a video um, on how to do the assignment and then also a rubric so let's just do lab one. I have a little image, I have a little uh, uh, a few sentences here uh, describing and explaining what we're doing. Uh, I have an entire full video on how to do the actual assignment. Um, not all assignments will have a document but I even have a Word document included on this one. Um, and then I also include a rubric on everything that you will be graded on. So um, be sure to uh, check through this but the video will go through and include any keyboard shortcuts you need. Um, however, I do leave a uh, Maya keyboard shortcuts link here also just in case. Um, that's about it for uh, the modules. So um, my name is Henrik Host Madsen. Uh, I am going to be your instructor for this course and this is 3D Modeling and Animation 1 online. Um, Monday through Friday are my office hours. I can, uh, depending on how or if you need an appointment, if you're only available on the weekend, I can probably work something out and meet with you on the weekend. Um, but go ahead and inbox me, right located right over here in Canvas, inbox me for an appointment and we can take it from there. And we can always try to troubleshoot any questions or you know problems that you're having with your uh, assignments or anything like that. Um, through inbox first and then if needed we can always meet up for an appointment uh, if necessary so uh, my contact information is right here uh, this is my uh, mchenry.edu email um, my uh, google meet email so if you're really sick and you're struggling with an assignment and you just can't get to the school or whatever um, we can try and meet on google meet uh, you can do some screen share or we can do some screen sharing and, and kind of troubleshoot what's going on if, if needed um, but I do believe you will need a gmail uh, email so which is really easy to make um, most of us already probably have one um, and my mobile phone number so this is in case of an emergency um, please don't text me uh, uh, message me on inbox first um, if it is an emergency, for whatever reason, uh, you're not going to be able to get your assignment in on time, uh, pending some type of really serious situation, shoot me a text or a phone call, uh, leave a message also um, in case I don't answer because I 
for whatever reason I may be busy or something and um, I will get back to you as soon as possible but canvas is the quickest response time um, you will you'll get from me so if you shoot me a message on inbox I'm usually really good about responding um, as quickly as possible um, sometimes instantly because I get uh, updates um, sent right to my phone and it will say uh, so and so send a message on canvas so um, I'm usually really good unless I'm unable to respond right away um, I'll respond at my uh, at the earliest possible time I can um, so we can go into the the syllabus we already covered the course modules in the syllabus here um, it breaks down uh, first all uh, first of all we have our uh, downloadable syllabus uh, this will be updated to 2019 fall a and I 105-001 um, but if you click on this link it will download for you um, and then you'll have a PDF of the syllabus also um, we have uh, everything laid out in here for the assignments as you notice the before you begin and getting started modules are not included in here but I cannot stress enough uh, that you will struggle in the beginning if you don't check those videos because um, it is a little uh, tricky to get used to especially if you're just diving right in and not sort of learning how to navigate through uh, Maya at all um, then I also have the uh, assignments right over here um, discussions labs so discussions are 20 percent of your grade labs are 20 percent of your grade midterm 20 percent of your grade final is 40 percent of your grade and uh, obviously it equals a total of a hundred percent so I leave reminders throughout the modules um, week by week uh, about uh, keeping up with the midterm and as well as the final so uh, be sure to sort of keep up on those while doing your assignments don't save them for last minute because they are so heavily graded um, alright and this will also have the due dates and uh, times that they are due so late work and course policies um, are so late work we'll start with late work late work will lose 20 percent of all possible or 20 late work will lose 20 percent of possible points for each day that it is late work will not be accepted more than five days late and ex, uh, except in cases of extreme emergency approved by the instructor so um, what that basically means is uh, after one day late it's 20 percent uh, deduction of your grade two days late 40 percent deduction of grade three days late 60% deduction of grade, four days late, 80% deduction of grade, five days late, on the fifth day it's a hundred percent deduction of your grade. So um, keep that in mind. Attendance. Uh, you are expected to check into this course on a weekly basis. Assignments will be unavailable five days after their due date. Participating in class on a weekly basis is essential to the successful completion of the course. Completing the material is your responsibility. Uh, and it's important to work with me, your instructor, if you are having any uh, emergencies or personal issues um, that uh, will, you know, possibly hinder you from getting your assignment in on time. So, uh, and be prepared to document any reasons that require you to hand in work late so doctor's note or something like that um, online tutoring you can click this link um, this will probably be totally updated so I'm not gonna bother clicking on it in this video uh, by the time um, classes start uh, it'll have all types of new information in here but you can go always go ahead and check into the uh, digital media tutoring canvas course um, this is where that before you begin video is right now that I'm showing you um, however I do believe I will post it higher up in the shell so all of this is sort of subject to change a little bit but all of the information will be the same and the layout will be identical um, alright so I cover these here um, as we get into more of week nine, 
is really the only time you'll need it. Um, as we get into the the courses and and you know in week nine inside of that little module and that assignment, I will have a video on what um, to do. So, but also you can get a free trial of this uh, Adobe software free trials. So you can even get tons of free trials on the software. So um, it'll help uh, reduce cost of this course uh, significantly. Um, I don't have any book, textbook that you will need. So right here, we do not have a textbook for this course. Um, but sort of the uh, the Premiere Pro for the one assignment. I think it's one or two assignments we will use it for. You can get a free trial. So um, the only one you will be using regularly throughout the semester is the Adobe Photoshop. Um, but a free trial will not last the entire uh, length of the course so you will need to use the educational license so be f be sure to check that getting started uh, module on downloading Adobe Photoshop uh, again another um, reminder canvas messaging me through canvas inbox is the best way to contact me this will also have the quickest response time um, another link to the syllabus we don't have a textbook and these are the softwares you will need. I'll include links down here and a reminder on late work. Okay, so that's really everything. Um, everything else is in here. Uh, I do post an announcements, so uh, from time to time you can click on uh, announcements. Here's one about finals week from the previous semester. Um, you should have like a notification that pops up that tells you that. Um, assignments, obviously, um, you can get all of your assignments also in here um, they're not in order in here for whatever reason but um, be sure to uh, check that out if you'd like I have my discussions in here so you can check all of the discussions um, grades I'm not going to click on right now but this is where you can find your grades uh, people in the class if you need to message anyone pages files uh, syllabus quizzes I don't have any quizzes so I can I can actually take that out that's one thing that'll be subject to change uh, by the time you see this so um, if you have any questions on this uh, be sure to message me on canvas so um, I don't believe this will work because I'm in student view but I'll go ahead and try yep so um, it'll have like a few icons up here that it's just like email it'll be like a little pen on a piece of paper or something icon uh, to compose new message you should be able to figure it out if you do have any issues with it uh, my phone number is there you can just go ahead and call me and I'll talk you through it or we can meet up and we can schedule an appointment and take care of it that way um, but other than that uh, that's how to navigate everything on the course the most important page is the modules um, to stay uh, to keep up along with the course so um, that's everything I've got for you. Again, uh, just shoot me a message or uh, contact me via phone if um, you're having any issues. And uh, yeah, just uh, keep up with the modules. But thank you for watching. Um, I hope this was helpful. And uh, have, uh, have a great semester.